Hey everybody, welcome back to VideoCreditScore.com. Today we're gonna to talk about closing down credit cards and how that impacts your credit score. So what do you think? Is this a good idea, a bad idea? Well, hopefully you've been on VideoCreditScore.com before. We've talked about this in our myths lesson and we've talked about this other places where closing credit cards is a bad idea from a credit score perspective. So this is because of amounts owed. Amounts owed are a key factor in determining your credit score. And it's not just looking at your total balances, but it's looking at your balances in ratio to your available credit limits. And you wanna keep this credit utilization ratio very low. Like 30% is great. Ideally, the best credit score people have 10% credit utilization ratios. So let's look at a couple scenarios. If you've got a bunch of cards, let's say you've got six cards with $30,000 in credit limits. And let's say you actually want to get rid of one of the cards that has a $10,000 limit on it. Well, now you've got five cards with $20,000 in limit. And if you're spending the same amount on those five cards that you wore on those six cards, you're now impacting that ratio, right? You're making it worse off, and that is going to ding you on your credit score. You're also gonna take a ding, let's say the card that we closed down in this scenario is a card that's 15 years old, has a lot of account history. You're gonna take a ding for that too, because now the average age of accounts actually goes down. So you wanna be aware of that as well. Let's look at another scenario. Well, what if you're somebody who's thinking about the, the situation of having six cards with kind of lower balances or three cards with um, higher balances? Well, the answer to this is it's better to actually have the six cards with lower balances. If you know, you're talking about 20 cards versus three cards, uh, then I might be you know, inclined to talk about the three cards is probably a better way to go. But in this scenario where you're talking about three cards versus six, Again, the reason you want more cards is not because of the cards themselves, but it's the credit utilization that comes with those cards. So don't get trapped in this myth. You know, what I want you to do is take your old cards, cut them up, throw them in a drawer, throw them in a safe, keep them in a safe place, and just don't use them. And that way your credit score will be in great shape. If you want to learn more, you know where to come, videocreditscore.com. You can also friend me up on Facebook and follow me on Twitter. See you soon. Remember, everyone's situation is different. Be sure to contact a financial advisor or a credit counseling professional before making important financial decisions. This video broadcast is for educational purposes and not a substitute for receiving personalized professional advice.